ভিডিও করছি তোদের তোদের ভিডিও করছে দেখালাম দেখ দেখে যা দেখে যা দেখে যা The reason many people don't know how to ask questions confidently is because some people, especially teachers in their schools, said to them, if you don't understand this concept, you can ask me 1,000 times. There was a teacher called Ashok, mathematical teacher in my Shiliguri Boys School. If you know my story, I didn't come from a great background. I can be the highest paid public speaker in India. I can be um, featured in Times of India, Conscious Millionaire, all that. I can be the, 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 the most sought after public speaking expert uh, in India and all that is fine. But um, I came from a small town, Shiliguri. I uh, studied in a Bengali medium government school and there in the school we had this bald kind of teacher, you know, always irritated kind of person and he came to the first class. Um, in his first uh, class, uh, I was in I think seventh grade and he said, if you don't, in Bengali, he said, if you don't understand a specific concept in mathematics, come to me any times, thousand times, I will teach you. So that's a great teacher, right? You've heard this thing before, he'll teach me thousand times if I don't get it. So first time I did not get it, so I raised my hand and said, like, sir, I don't get it, this uh, formula that you're teaching, I don't get it. Um, he said, fine, um, second time he taught it, sir, I don't get it, uh, this part, he was not very calm anymore, he taught it the second time. The third time I said, sir, he said, just shut up and sit down. I can't teach you so many times. Now, have you had a teacher like this who said, I'll teach you a thousand times and then you ask three times and they are <laughs> their inner self comes out. That's because in our culture, in our society, asking questions is not part of creativity. Answering questions is the part of creativity. If you know answers, you are creative. That's not creativity. Creativity is challenging, it's questioning. It's like, what is that tree about? What is this color about? What is this? Because when you expand your mind, that's when you gain confidence. How it relates to you? There are some things you hesitate about asking. Maybe in that meeting, you don't understand what is QTP, which is ROI, but you think, if I raise my hands, everybody will think I'm stupid, so I'll not raise my hands. That is called hesitation. And here's the thing, hesitation stops you from getting satisfaction. If you want to be really confident, don't be afraid to ask that question. So the next time you don't understand ROI, say, hey, I have a question. I don't know, maybe it's, it's a common term for this, but I don't get it, so I want to be involved in your presentation. Can you and tell me what is ROI quickly? Ask it. Sometimes people will say, you don't know ROI? You know, oh my God. Like, that's their judgment. You are doing it for yourself. It's your confidence. You don't know anything, you ask it. And I encourage you, not just you, as a father, as a mother, encourage your children to ask questions as many times. Not just the three, four times like my mathematical teacher in my mathematics teacher, but I encourage people to ask questions. Um, that's how you gain the confidence. That's how you believe in yourself. That's how you, you know, you take things and you take it to another level in life because you become curious to explore things, to expand things so that you can get the experience and the confidence to become powerful. I want to see you soon. My name is Bishal Sarkara. Always reminding you that public speaking is not about perfection. It's all about connection. <laughs>